Well, today we're just 30 minutes or so from one of Germany's great historic cities, Heidelberg. We're at the Pre-Zero Arena in Zinsheim. I'm Derek Ray, joined here on the commentary box, as always, by Lee Dixon. And very much looking forward to bringing you live action from the Bundesliga in a matter of moments. It's Hoffenheim taking on Mainz. Cheers, Derek. Yeah, really excited about this one. Looking forward to some entertaining end-to-end -end football. Well, every football coach likes to have a versatile forward in his ranks. Andre Kramaric is certainly one such player. Lee, what do you think we might see from him today? Well, his ability on the ball is second to none. Just watch how close he keeps the ball to his feet. He lures defenders in. Then quick turn of pace and he's away from you. Brilliant player. A look at the initial 11 for Hoffenheim. Pretty well balanced this formation, Lee. Yeah, it can be a 4 2 3 1 in the offensive mode, but it can also go back to a 4 5 1 when you're defending. The lone striker will be supported by the three just behind him, especially the number 10 who will be given a free roll. Here's the initial 11 for Mainz. The wing backs are going to be crucial in this setup. You've played in that position, Lee. Yeah, I didn't really like it. And we always thought when we were playing against five at the back with the wing backs exposed like this in this formation, that a 4 4 2 can really create a 2 v 1 down the side. So keep your eye out for that. And the three narrow midfield players supply the support for the two forwards up front. Kramaric. Bebu with it. Kramaric. And he saw the situation developing. Andre Kramaric. Baumgartner. And Kramaric on the ball. Bebu. Kramaric. Accurate pass upon accurate pass. Options in the centre. Well, high marks for that pass. Baumgartner. Kramaric. Must be, and still danger here. And a throw in forthcoming. Kader Zabek. Kevin Vogt. Can he finish? Just cutting off the supply. And he read it well. Andre Kramaric. Bebu with it. Dorian Grilic. Untidy in possession. And they continue to advance. And a lot of options here. Samaseku. Oh, they're sitting ever deeper. The referee spotted the infringement and it will be a free kick in a position of genuine menace. Defending to prevent the chance. Kramaric.
and lining it up. Sessegnon. Well, that's a really good authoritative tackle. Throw in here. Baumgartner. Now well, they've given him too much space. Kramaric. Well, nothing productive, really. Throw-ins given. Da Costa. Dominic Coa. An effective ball. Passing it around, looking for the goal that would put them ahead. They've lost it. Lorian Grilic. Bebu with it. A fine reading of the situation. Couldn't keep it. Andre Kramaric. Well, he's given it away. Bebu. Robert Scoff. Crossing opportunity. It's opening up for them. Able to deal with the threat. Boetius. And plenty of scope to be creative in that wide position. Dangerous looking attack. Cool. Can they forge ahead? No, chance missed. Well, it's a big opportunity squandered there. They'll be disappointed with that. Really effective shielding under pressure. Miyakate. Jean-Paul Boetius. Promising looking attack. Just knocking it around, looking to carve out a chance. Excellent defending. Offenheim enjoying the bulk of possession here, but that doesn't lead to goals necessarily. They haven't created enough. Too slow up front, midfield, very average. The coach, he's not happy at all. He wants more from this team. And unable to keep possession. Philip Mwene. Niakate. Danny Da Costa. He's in behind. Can he finish? And it's in! 1 0. They breach the defence. Well, as we can see again here, he knows exactly what he's doing and kids all the defenders with the cutback. But then there's plenty to do from there. He's hit it so well. Lots of pace, lots of power and the keeper just can't react in time. Great strike. And with that, the first half draws to a close. 
And most fans would be pretty happy with this man's display so far. Well, his manager will be delighted with him. He's been spot on in this game, hasn't he? Energy, imagination, desire, and a steely determination. The teams are ready to have a go at each other again as the second half commences. Andrei Kramaric. On to Samaseku. Making excellent progress with the ball at his feet. Uh, the keeper completely untroubled. Well, they're sitting ever deeper. We're getting the ball forward. Can't miss, surely! And he's done it! Parate again! A magnificent game unfolding. Obviously, it's a tapping, Derek, but it's the patience in the box I like. A predator's instinct, just waiting for the ball to come to him. A chance to revisit the goal. So, a level contest, 1-1. One, one. Jean-Paul Boetius. Da Costa, chance to do damage. Not showing good patience. And giving it away. Florian Grelic. Andrei Kramaric. Grelic now. Pavel Karajabek on the ball. Looking for that final pass. Looking for the goal that would put them ahead. And a goal to delight the fans. Just what they were hoping for. Well, here we see it again, a lovely pass is a pure quality passing, fluid as you like, and still with lots to do, he unleashes a very powerful effort, gave the keeper little chance, lovely goal that was. Well, 2-1 it is here. And space for the cross. Boetius. Croa. Jean-Paul Boetius. Well, that's the kind of player you want from your defender. Stefan Posch. Andrei Kramaric. Well, keeping hold of the ball. What it's all about for them. Losing possession here. Lorian Grelic. Kevin Vogt. On to Samaseku. Robert Skoff. Keeping the ball moving. Kader Zabek. Kramaric. This looks promising. Mastery of the passing game. And space to cross it. Sessegnon. 
He cuts it back and delivered towards the back post. They've gone and scored again. They're doing everything in their power to make sure they're not pegged back. Well, here's the replay. Great disguise on the pullback cross. And he gets up for the header. And quite frankly, it's a lovely finish. Brilliant goal. Well, the goal again, albeit from a different angle. No shortage of goals in this match. 3-1. Sie wollen wissen, wie es weitergeht? Dann schauen Sie auf unserer Internetseite vorbei. Dort finden Sie alle Infos und noch viel mehr. Vielen Dank. Stefan Bell. Well, nicely cut out. Offenheim enjoying the bulk of possession here. If you have that much of the ball, you can put pressure on the opposition defence. And they look like they're creaking. That's why they're winning comfortably. Bebu. That's a very impressive piece of defending. And it's a matter of what occurs in the final 15 minutes. Jean Paul Boetius. He's lost it. Kader Jabek. Now with Samaseku. Diadi Samaseku. Baumgartner. Sessegnon. Just looking for the right moment for that final pass. Disappointing pass. Da Costa. Core in possession. That's how to dispossess your opponent. Robert Scoff. And it's with Vogt. Lorian Grilic. And five minutes to go. Bebu. Can they trouble the opposition this time? Untidy on the ball. Philip Mwene. And the ball with Onisibo. And teammates to play it to. There has been plenty of limbering up from substitutes. And now both sides will make personnel switches. It looks as though they had attacking momentum, but not so. The referee blows for full time. It ends at a victory for the home team. No complaints from the fans here. Well, Derek, when the lead is extended to a two-goal margin, you could almost hear the sigh of relief from their supporters and the manager too. And I think it's accurate to say, Lee, that this man was the light bringer for his side. Well, he played well, scored a goal. What a good performance from him.